Hey lovies, it's me, Nisha, coming to y'all today, froed out as you can see. Do you see it? Yes, it is growing, you guys. I'm still amazed. It is so growing. But I um have not been deep conditioning my hair like I should have. And because of it, I have suffered some breakage and like some extreme itching for some reason. And so I decided to not use my regular um, ORS replenishing conditioner that I usually use to deep condition my hair because um, it just wasn't working. So I decided to go pick up the deep conditioner by Pantene, the Truly Natural um, deep conditioner. And I haven't tried it yet. I still haven't tried it. I bought this from, where did I get this from? I think Walgreens for $4.99. And, um, yeah, so I was on YouTube doing some searching and trying to figure out what I could use for my hair because of, um, the itching and the dryness and, um, it just haven't been my, my regular TWA. Um, I know it's because I have neglected my hair for at least three weeks. Like, I haven't deep conditioned in two weeks and... I've just been co-washing. You know what I mean? Just co-washing. I haven't did a apple cider vinegar rinse in quite some time. You know what I mean? So I've just been so busy with other things and worried about other shit. And so I have just neglected my hair. So I was on YouTube, like I was saying, searching for something to use for my hair. And I came across a couple of videos that was using um, Queen Helene's Cholesterol hair conditioning cream and so I remember no I didn't have this one I had the one by Lusters I think it was orange um, when I was relaxed and I used to use that but I never did see a difference or whatever so I threw it out didn't worry about it but I've seen a lot of naturals using this so I decided to go pick it up and I got it from my local beauty supply store for oh I took the sticker off it was $2.99 you know so if you don't know what it looks like it smells like lotion. It looks like this. It's yellow on the inside. And I'm going to use it today to try to bring some life back to his TWA, honey. Okay? Like, she needs to be brought back to life, like, ASAP. So I'm going to use this. I'm going to deep condition for about an hour. Yeah, like an hour, maybe an hour and 15 minutes or so, because it really, like, needs to do some work do some extra stuff and so then when i wash this out i will then co-wash with the um pantene truly natural co-wash um conditioning cleansing conditioner so i'm going to use that and then as i rinse this out i'm going to follow up with my apple cider vinegar rinse because i do need to do one and that is going to be my deep conditioning um regimen for now on um, well, if I like it, I'm not going to say from now on, if I like it, that's going to be my, um, deep conditioning regimen for now on. Um, so yeah, so stay tuned to see what's going to happen. Okay. Bye, love you. Okay. What I have done is saturated my hair with water. Um, and I'm going to slap on some of the Queen Helene's hair conditioning cream. And it really is like a cream. It's very, very thick. And, um, I'm hoping it just don't sit on the top of my hair. That's usually why I don't use, like, cream conditioners or whatnot, like, really thick ones. Because they don't really condition. They just actually sit on the top of my hair. But, yeah, so I'm going to slap it on the front. And actually all around. I remember them creamy crack days when you used to perm your own hair. What? I used to have to get them sides, slick them down. I right, like y'all don't remember. All of us ain't been natural that long. But anywho. So I'm going to take that much and get up in this middle piece up in this thick section 
I'm not mixing anything with it. I'm just going to see what it do by itself. And then if I need to do an updated video on how I deep condition it, if I decided to add something else to it, I will let you guys know. So, I really detangles really good too. Check that out. I know that's right. Yes. I like that part so far. So now I'm just going to distribute it through evenly with my wide tooth comb. You know, make sure it's all up in there. Y'all see how thick that stuff is up in there? Honey. I think that's the only part I'm going to hate about this natural hair. Like, my hair, when it was relaxed, it was very, very thick. So, I already know I'm going to have a damn bush. But I'm excited. I can't wait till it get really, really big because I love big hair. You know, so yeah, I'm going to finish combing this out and like evenly, uh -oh, I need to add some more, like evenly distribute it through my hair. Have y'all seen how much my hair has grown since I dyed it in February? Awesome, right? So yeah, I'm going to finish doing this and probably when y'all see me again, it'll be after I rinse everything out. Okay. Okay, I have washed out all of the Queen Helene's um, cholesterol hair conditioning cream and I have co-washed it as well. My hair is so freaking soft, y'all. It's like so soft. I ain't even saw that out, I see. Damn it, where's my shirt? Oh, I don't want to touch my hair with this towel. But yeah, anywho, I got to get the rest of that out of my hair. I think I was like so excited because it was so soft. But I'm about to spray my hair down with my apple cider vinegar and water mix because my hair has been itching. My hair, my scalp has been itching like crazy. And I really can't get with the tea tree oil. Like a lot of people have been telling me try tea tree oil and whatnot, but the smell is god awful like to me it just smells so bad and i just i can't i really can't get with it but yeah i put this on my hair and then i usually rinse it right out i don't really have a time frame that i keep it on there and you see it actually removes build up so that's why i'm not too worried about the um the conditioner that's left in there. So yeah, that's what I do. I spray it on there. And oh the smell. It's awful, but it rinse right out when you um rinse your hair out. Like the smell is not stuck in your hair. That's the one thing I like about it. And it makes my curls pop like for real. Do an apple cider vinegar rinse and watch how your curls come to life. And I really love it because it really, like, get all the stuff about your hair. Like, that condition that's left over, once I rinse it out, it ain't going to be no more. So, that's why I'm not even worried. But, this smell is getting to me, so I will see y'all in a minute. Okay, I have rinsed the apple cider, apple cider, apple cider vinegar out of my hair. And, when I tell y'all my hair is so soft, like, it's so freaking soft. I, I like this damn deep conditioner. So what I'm about to do is use this uh, Motions Nourish Leave-In Conditioner on my hair because um, I'm going to try this new gel and um, the Pantene Truly Natural. I don't have it in here. The 
the fine curl custard on my hair. So, I'm about to do like a little wash and go. I'm not going to, um, well, I may like leave a little section up here in the front and show you guys how I do it. I may do that. Once I'm done with the back and all of that good stuff. So, yeah. May have another part to this video. And I'm sorry if I'm not looking at y'all. The mirror, like a big mirror is behind me. So, that's what I see. And, yeah. TWA, wash fresh. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. I'm about to do a wash and go. So, talk to you guys soon. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thumbs up, like, comment, share. Do the damn thing, alright? I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.